Hello and good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to Fusico. Welcome at GIFA 2011. This year, we have a special guest at GIFA 2011. It's Lady Melt. May I introduce you to Lady Melt? She's like a human being and made of vital organs. And she must take care of her health to achieve a regular ductile iron quality day after day. Her liquid iron stream is similar to our human bloodstream, both behave in the same way. In order to stay fit, she follows a strict diet to protect her heart and to regulate her pulse. That's the aim of the Initec treatment process. She takes preventive action against disease and follows a homeopathic cure. That job is done by the MSI dispenser. And she regularly analyzes samples of her blood to confirm best practice and anticipates changing working conditions. She's assisted by Itaka Thermal Analysis. So let's have a look at how and what she does to stay in such good health. When our activity is slow, like walking, our hearts don't beat fast and the oxygen requirement of our blood is low. When our activity is intense, like sprinting, our hearts beat much faster and the oxygen requirement of our blood is intense. The same happens in a mail shop. If liquid metal demand is low, oxygen activity within a liquid iron is low. If liquid metal demand is high, oxygen activity within a liquid iron is high. Here we have an important point. This variable can cause mechanical property failures or casting defects. The process is not consistent because the conditions change according to the fluctuations in oxygen activity. And this forms unwanted magnesium sulfides and oxides. So, what can we do to take control of the ductile iron quality and the operational costs? The answer, the Initec process. This process initializes the primary oxygen variable of the base iron and eliminates it. To achieve this amazing feat, Foseco has designed a new treatment vessel, the Foseco converter. The Foseco converter can do two treatments, one after the other. First, the initializing step to control the oxygen variable. Second, the magnesium reaction to obtain graphite nodules after solidification. To manage these two treatment steps, the converter can rotate backward and forward. And now let's look inside. The converter is lined with Caltech material. This is a low density lining material with a very efficient insulating performance. And you may wonder why a prism shape for a converter? The answer, this is thermally very efficient. In the horizontal position it minimizes the heat loss due to radiation from the liquid surface and in the vertical position it maximizes the metallostatic pressure over the magnesium alloy. And now we preload the converter with our magnesium alloy nodulant. The addition rate of magnesium alloy is cut in half. Then we rotate the converter 90 degrees backward. Now Inodex is loaded into the main body coming from right as you can see here. And the Inodex is now in the perfect position to meet the liquid base iron stream in the, from the melting furnace first. Inodex dissolves in the liquid base iron, the initializer controls the oxygen variable and generates strong nucleation. Now, excess nuclei rise to the liquid surface and protect the melt from the atmosphere. 
The magnesium alanodulant is kept safe and away and therefore not, does not react. When the iron meets the nodulant, the magnesium reaction starts. At this point you can see an important advantage of this flexible converter. With this system you can control the starting point of, uh, of the magnesium reaction. So you can decide when the magnesium reaction starts, a definite asset. The magnesium recovery increases up to 97%. This represents two major benefits to you. You can get the highest possible magnesium recovery. Key factors for that is the converter capacity and its operating conditions. And you can save major costs on a metallic charge because the carbide and shrinkage promoting effect of magnesium is kept to a minimum. After the deslagging operation, the Fuseco converter is utilized as a purring ladder. Its vertical prism shape is perfect for this precise operation. The Initech treated ductile iron has exceptionally good fluidity and the formation of oxides and sulfides is under your control. You can reduce pouring temperatures by at least 30 to 50 degrees. To guarantee best metal treatment practice, we pour a sample of the Initech treated ductile iron into an Itaka cup. The metal cools and the cooling curve is recorded by the Itaka software, and this software shows in real time how the metal solidifies. The software contains useful information on metal quality and suggests simple corrective actions. The brain measures the metallurgical condition of the iron before and after treatment. This is a multi-channel system and can control several furnaces. All data is recorded and safely stored. Complete traceability of the ductile iron quality is possible. We can couple Itaka to spectrometer readings, be online with the foundry quality department and web linked to our metallurgical expertise center in Italy. The MSI method stream in the MSI method stream inoculation systems provide a final adjustment of the inoculation state of the iron. In order to achieve consistent solidification, a small quantity of inoculin has to be added to the melt as late as possible, ideally as it enters to the mold cavity. This is done by the use of a dispenser, a camera and a control panel. The high and consistent quality of the Initech treated ductile iron reduces the foundry process casting, finishing and cleaning costs. The entire foundry process benefits from better metallurgy. Let's recap the advantages. Cheap charge recipe formulation new levels of treatment performance, long-lasting nodulizing effect, lower purring temperatures, direct purring, a single vessel for all steps, improved surface finish and casting yield, stable and superior mechanical properties. Fusico has worldwide patterns for the Initech designs and Initech treatment processes. Details can be seen here on our Fusico stand where our team is available to give you more information. Thanks a lot for your attention. I wish you a pleasant day.